Hey guys, uh, Dave here again. Welcome back. This is our second video and uh, what we're going to be discussing is adding configurations to our bulk file. Okay, let's get started. I'm going to open up the uh, original bolt file we did uh, last video. And um, if you haven't watched that and want to check it out, I'll put a link uh, up at the top right here. Um, and um, you can go back and check it out. Um, but as far as uh, this video is concerned, we're going to be talking uh, about adding configurations. So if you go to the configurations tab and just simply scroll down and add configuration, we have a cap screw. And uh, so let's make uh, let's turn this into a socket head cap screw uh, one thing is you want to make sure that you have suppressed features clicked and I'll, uh, I'll explain that a little bit later so there we can see uh, check yes and we can see that we have our socket head uh, listed there and uh, what we need to do is suppress our original um, head configuration so we'll suppress that boss extrude and uh, we'll start adding in the geometry, creating the geometry for our socket head. And so pick the face, same face, and uh, create a circle diameter. And uh, we'll uh, put a diameter of uh, 3 eighths of an inch, 0.375 uh, on that. And we're going to extrude that up, um, let's say, a quarter inch. Uh, should be good. And there we have our starting, our base for our uh, new uh, socket head. And uh, next thing we need to do is, is put in the um, hex recess. And so we can have our hex tool and uh, put in a, a diameter there. And uh, we'll put a 3 16 And uh, it should be good. Uh, whoop, nope. Uh, not 0.316, uh, just 3 sixteenths. And then uh, we want to fix one one side of that horizontally or vertically, whatever you want. We're going to extrude that. And uh, let's extrude that um, 3 sixteenths as well. And um, all right, so uh, we're looking pretty good there. Um, Last thing I'm going to do is, is put a little chamfer on the top of the head. Uh, not an eighth of an inch. but uh, So just to give it a little bit of visual reveal. And um, it's pretty much uh, all done. And there's our bolt. Uh, quickly converted over from a standard cap screw to a socket head cap screw. You can see as we uh, shift back and forth in between our original configuration and uh, the one we just made. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, join us for our next video where we'll talk about adding some more configurations, uh, file management, and as always, uh, give us a like and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.